Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. My name is the Lady Zana, and we're here with a Europe pack announcement. Welcome five fascinating species to your zoo, including the snow-dwelling Eurasian lynx, the climbing alpine ibex, the social European badger, the European fallow deer, and the reclusive fire salamander. Build and decorate your zoo using more than 250 fresh creative options inspired by picturesque European locations, including iconic cities such as Venice and Amsterdam and uh, mesmerizing winter markets from Central Europe. You will also be able to try a festive new challenge, a new time scenario set in the foothills of the snowy Alps. Now without further talking, I have not seen the trailer yet, so let's just check that one out and then we're gonna go through it slowly to see what kind of new things and new animals we can spot. All right, let's go over the trailer and see what new things we can spot. I do you think that these are new festival items? This might be a little new stairs, but it could also be made out of Asian planks. Uh, there is a balcony right over here. I'm not really sure if that is like uh, more like railing pieces, a modular balcony, or maybe a balcony piece uh, by itself. These little things look new. I'm not really sure if these windows are new or that we already had these with the uh, classical theme. Obviously, this bridge is also new. I'm not really sure if this is like one piece or that these are modular pieces. We have to wait and see about that. This looks very smooth to me. So this might be uh, um, uh, one piece to make a bridge out of or just one bridge piece, I should say. Uh, there might also be some kind of new wall right over here, but it could also be the uh, Asian set. Uh, something new right over here looks like. I'm not really sure if these planters are new. We also had something like that, I think, in Planet Coaster. Other than that, I don't really see anything new right over here. So let's continue with the next shot. I do think that this boat is more of like a, a scenery piece. I don't think that is right. I think then they would have told us. Obviously, this is like uh, the typical Dutch style. So we do, uh, we are getting some new Dutch pieces right over here. I don't really, I'm not really sure if this is like a new wall set with like integrated windows. Maybe uh, the walls are made out of pillars. So it's just made around the windows. Either way, I do really like this uh, this new wall set. That looks really cool, actually. And I think it also looks recolorable. These are classical pieces that we already have in the game. So this is definitely a mixture of like the classical theme that we already have with some new pieces, most likely. And this bridge also looks new to me. Like this is definitely like a different type of bridge. This is, ooh, this is uh, more of like the limestone. No, not a limestone. Where do I recognize this from? I'm not really sure actually. I'm not really sure if we got like several bridges that are just one piece or that we got like pieces that we are able to make bridges. I'm, I'm really curious to see more about that. I do see uh, some shutters right over here as well. I don't think these are new trees. All right, so this looks like, is this like a new pop texture? I'm not really sure actually. These railings are new. These are classical railings. I don't think that we already had those. These are Asian pillars. We already had those. This is, I think, just a piece of the boat. This could probably be either one piece or like modular new pieces. I don't really recognize this railing. So it depends a little bit. It could be uh, belonging to the boat, but it could also be that these are separate pieces or just one piece. I'm not really sure. This definitely looks like a new wall to me and some new lights right over here. I do really like that. 
Also these new Dutch pieces. Uh, I'm not really sure if this clock is new. I, I do remember that we, I think we have a clock in the game, but this, this does look like a new clock to me. So I'm not entirely sure about that. These little flags, did we already have these flags in the game? Start to doubt myself if we already did. Like these could be recolorable flags that we already had in the game. Other than that, I don't really think there is anything new in this picture. So let's go, or picture, <laughs> video shot, but let's continue. All right, we already had bicycles. This, this looks like a new decorative item to me. I'm not really sure if this door is new. It might be a new door, but we do have some classical doors in the game. So I'm not entirely sure. Uh, this looks in, like a new sign to me, definitely. Other than that, uh, we see more of the Dutch theme here, but I'm not... I don't really... This might be a new pot, by the way. Like, these flowers I don't recognize as the flowers that we can put down, so I'm not really sure. This, these might be... This might be a new planter, actually, with a, with a flower. I do really like that we have... We got, like, these smaller flowers to use in these pots, so that's really nice. Okay, let's see... Can't really tell what's on this sign, as if it's like they're telling you like, yeah, well, there's nothing in this habitat right now. <laughs> there's definitely not an animal in here. Uh, these are new. These like new. I think these are badgers. That looks really cute. I think these also uh, light up in a later stage. These are Asian flowers you already had. This looks like anything that we have. Maybe these pillars are new, but we ha already have so many wooden pillars, so... It could be that we already have them in the game, actually. I'm not entirely sure. Can't really see any animal in this habitat. This in the background definitely looks new to me with these windows. That is really cool. I think this is the stone textures that we just saw. So I do really like that we are getting a, a new type of stone building set. I do really like that. I'm curious how these edges will look when we uh, see them more close into the game. Okay, so we have more of the Dutch style right over here, more shutters. There's a little van right over here, so we can make our own uh, little food trucks now. So that is really cool. I do really like that. I, I'm expecting this one to be recolorable. Uh, I think I can't really tell what is in this habitat though. So we have to wait and see about that, I guess. Uh, a lot more Dutch style, these railings. I don't think these... Um, lights are new i think we already have these in the game these classical lights could be wrong but I, I don't think so all right i think this is a modular bridge it's definitely a, a, a dutch bridge <laughs> you, you see this a lot in the netherlands this is again the 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 stone walls i do really like this by the way this is like looks like moss or anything like that uh, i do really hope that these are like separate pieces so we can use this in uh, wherever we want to i think that would be just super amazing we might get some new planters here as well i think these are all new i think these all belong to the pack with all the new animals this one also looks in what i actually started out myself i'm actually not entirely sure uh you can see more of the new i'm not really sure if this is a new wall set this could definitely just be uh, pillars and then uh, a new window inside of it so not like a wall with a window integrated like it, it might be just windows with with pillars around it or something like that and then we see another uh, more of the of the dutch theme right over here this might be a new awning but it could also be already in the game the classical awning that we have here we can see more of the shutters uh, we might get this new chain link. I don't really, I'm not, it depends if this is like one piece or that this is modular. So it could be that the pieces of this bridge are all separate in the game. That would be really nice so to have these type of, uh, of, of building pieces. Other than that, I don't really think that there is anything new. This could be a new tree, maybe some kind of enrichment item, but it's too far away to really tell, I guess. All right, let's continue. Ah, that's beautiful. Look at it all lighting up. All these beautiful little lights. I do really like that. I think for anyone that wants to uh, decorate your zoo a little bit more festive, you uh, can really eat your heart out with all the new little lights. Even though I know that we already had like festive lights in... Uh, I think there are some festive stuff in the Arctic pack as well, or was with a free update or something like that. So. We already had some things in the game and I actually never used them in the game, so I'm not 
100% sure how many of uh, these lights are actually new, but I, I do think they are new. But correct me if I'm wrong. Aw, pretty light, pretty salamander. <laughs> And more, some more uh, festive lights right over here. And then we go to a little Christmas market. Now, as I said, I, I'm not really sure if these uh, trees are new or that we already have them in the game, but I didn't just never use them. You at least get like these uh, items right over here to get, uh, to create your own little Christmas market or something like that. I think that's really cute. This is a food truck, uh, probably recolored. I think that is the same. But it could be wrong here as well. I think you see like this Christmas star and some, um, what else do we have here? I think this is also new. I think we see a close up later on here as well. Yeah, look at this. Look how cool that is looking. I do really love that. That looks amazing. These lights, these lanterns are probably new as well. Not entirely sure what this is, like the, the difference with the stone and the limestone could be something just sticking out. I'm actually not entirely sure. Look at this shot, by the way. That is from the free update. Ah, that looks really amazing. I love it that we're getting these, uh, these... Now I forgot. <laughs> the shop. The shop counters. I actually had to look it up. I keep forgetting the name. Shop counters. We're getting new shop counters. If you have not seen the free update video yet, I definitely... I highly recommend you to watch that video as well. It's already up on the channel because every DLC comes along with a big free update and this one is uh, definitely really cool with some shop counters and memorials and uh, yes, definitely go and check that one out. But yeah, I do really, I like the festive stuff, but I'm not, I, I don't think I'm going to use it that much, but it's definitely nice for people that wants to uh, bring, bring that festive vibe to their zoos as well. And then we have some footage of the beautiful lynx right over here. I think this one looks absolutely amazing, does it? Wait a second, what is that in the background though? Do you see that? I'm not really sure if this is new stuff, but it looks really pretty. But gosh, the lighting here with this lynx, that looks just so amazing. Just look at it. Well, one thing we do know, Frontier knows how to make cats. They are amazing. They look absolutely stunning. So yeah, the 14th of December, this Europe pack is coming to you with the Eurasian Lynx, the Alpine Ibex, the European Badger, the Fallow Deer, and the Fire Salamander. And I'm actually expecting a Fire Salamander to be an exhibit animal and the rest uh, being a habitat animal. And on Steam right over here, we have some more pictures. Now this is more of like an overview picture, so I don't really think that we can spot that many new things, but this is definitely that new stone wall set that we already saw in the trailer. On the next screenshot, we see the beautiful Eurasian links right over here and more of the uh, theme that we are getting, but I'm not really sure if there is anything new in here to be completely honest. There might be some new trims and stuff, but we already have so many limestone trims that I'm actually not sure what is new, <laughs> what is not. So it goes for the uh, the windows, but the links absolutely looks beautiful. Then we see another picture of this building style. So this is the uh, stone wall set. We see some more moss, I think, right over here. And then we have this boat scenery piece, I'm guessing. I don't really think that there is anything new in here that we have not seen yet. So let's go to the next picture. Now we have this cute little picture of the Alpine e-bikes. Look how adorable they are looking. Now the doll sheep was definitely one of my favorite animals of the uh, Arctic pack. So I do think that they're saying it's a climbing Alpine e -bag, So I do think that their animations and traversable area will be probably the same as the doll sheep. So that is really cool because then they can really climb and, and jump from one rock to the other rock. Uh, so yeah, this is definitely one of the most exciting animals to build a habitat for, I think, from this pack. Uh, to get a mid probably the Eurasian lynx. Uh, but I think, I think this one is going to be a little bit more uh, interesting in regards to a habitat. And then we have another picture of the uh, Christmas market right over here with some new pieces of the pack. So yeah, the Europe pack coming to you the 14th of December. 
I can't say I'm excited about this pack as much as I was from the other packs. Like the North America pack, I also wasn't really excited of, but later on I was actually really happy with it. I'm very curious for this pack what the new items will be. I am not being super excited about that yet. I'm very curious to see more about that because well, I'm using a lot of the classical themes, so I can totally see that we're getting like a really nice uh, addition to the limestone pieces. So I'm going to be very happy with that. But as of right now, I just can't really tell from the trailer how much there is that I would be using for my zoos. So yeah, I'm, I'm in general just very curious to see what kind of new pieces we are actually getting with this pack. But first glance, I am not as excited about this one in comparison to the other packs and the other stuff that we got so far. I do really like the animals, but it's not like these animals are super hyping me up at this point. Hopefully that will change as soon as I get my hands on the pack. I'm very uh, excited to see them and to check it all out and to check out all the pieces of the pack and... Uh, to see how I feel if I get my hands on the pack. But as of right now, I'm not as excited as the other packs that we have gotten so far. So yeah, I'm very curious to hear, of course, what your opinion so far is of the Euro pack, this announcement and this trailer, what we have seen so far. Let me know in the comments down below. Let me know if you are excited about these animals and what is your most favorite animal of this pack. Let me know your opinion. I'm very uh, curious to hear how you guys feel about this pack so far. Leave a like in the video if you guys enjoyed and subscribe, of course, if you haven't already. And yeah, I just really do hope to see you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys.